The API Explorer gives you an interface for browsing and querying the available APIs in Liferay DXP. So here I can choose the API I want to check. For example, delivery. Here I can see a list of all the elements I can access from the API, like blog posts, comments, content structures, and documents. Let's look at a document. For each element and type, you can see a different endpoint. So if I want to retrieve a document from a site, I can do that. Fill in the site ID, a parameter for search, sorting, and then click Execute. Right here, I can see the curl command to get all the information I retrieved from the response. The content URL, the modification, the keywords. In this case, it retrieved for images. I can also check an example response and schema if I want to know what each element means. In addition to being able to explore all the REST APIs, you can click on the GraphQL client and check different queries, necessary fields, and more, making it easy to define and test queries. The improved Responsive Layouts Editor makes adapting page content for each kind of device simple. This page, for example, has different kinds of content for advertising our new bicycle store. At the top, you can change the device and aspect to see what the page will look like. This page doesn't look great in the portrait phone aspect, so the editor allows me to change the layout for the grids to make the image and text look better. Now if I return to the desktop view, you can see that the original layout hasn't changed. Each aspect can be configured and customized independently of the rest, ensuring the best user experience across all devices. Stylebooks allow you, as the designer, to define how you want the common elements across your site to look. So one change in the stylebook changes the whole site. Here, for example, I can choose blue as the primary color and choose a different green as the success color. You can also change spacing, general, layout, typography, and buttons. Let's choose buttons and change the background color to this fuchsia. Now we publish. Once changes are published, if you go to a specific page, you can see the change you've made right away. Here's our fuchsia. Looking for more on 7.3? Subscribe and hit the bell for notifications to stay tuned for more in-depth feature videos.